Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create business collage animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back. And first one, select is UST money layers and height. Also laptop, one and two height. Select is businessman PNG image and move to center. Let's enable title action save and press S, change scale and move to down. Let's go to layer, new and solid layer. Add name background and click OK. Move to behind of layers and let's change work area. Okay, so go to effects presses, search effect gradient ramp, choose gradient ramp, use for background layer and go to start color, choose black like this and end color, let's choose like this, click OK and ramp shape, choose here red ramp and swap colors and choose this point, let's move to down and this move to center like this and for remove this noise, let's write ramp scatter 100% or 200 OK so let's go to again layer new and solid layer add name grid click ok move to behind of layers and go to fs presses search fa grid choose grid from generate folder let's use for grid side layer and size form choose with slider chain slider and opacity okay let's hide title action save and in this time, go to FS Presses Source FXCC Lens and use Lens for Grid, Change Size. Okay, that's good. So in this time, select this Businessman layer. Let's click for Turn on 3D layer. Also, let's go to Composition Settings, 3D Render and choose Render Engine, Normal Classic 3D. Click OK. And let's add new camera tool. Right click, New and Camera and I will use presets 50 millimeters. click OK. So, in this time, select this camera 1, let's create controller with null object, right click, go to camera and create orbit null. And for move to anchor point center, hold control, double click pen behind icon, click tool and go to text, let's write here business, click turn on thread layer and let's go to active camera, choose first custom view 1, and select this business text layer. Let's move to back and back to top view. And let's move to back like this. And select this businessman and move to like this here and active camera. So in this time, select this text and press S, change scale. And this businessman layer, press S, change scale and move to down. So press C for camera control, let's see, OK. And in this time, select this camera null and press P. Let's move to up and go to here. Let's create new passing Q frame. Go to one seconds and move to down. Select two frames, make it easy. Go to graph editor and make it smooth graph. Let's see. And this two frame of the left. Back to two frames, select less two frame of the right for more. Okay, so in this time, select this text and go to first second and let's move to up and go to window, open animation comes as 3, start a process and transition text layers, anime characters, choose overshot and position, click in, close window. And let's see. Okay, so select this text layer and press S and let's create scale Q frame, go to last Q frame and change scale like this and go to back, hold shape, press P, let's create new passing Q frame, go to back and move to down. Okay. 
Okay, select two frames and make it easy. And preview animation. Nice. Let's select this camera console, press P. And let's go to here and move to back with the Z axis. And in this time, select these USC layers. Let's enable and turn on 3D layer. Go to top view. And let's see, this is businessman layer and USC 1. Let's move to like this. And USC 2, move to here. USC 3, move to like this. USD 4, move the game front, and USD 5, USD 6, and 7, and 8. And back to custom view 1. Let's see. Okay, active camera. And let's prepare full scene. In this time, select these USC layers, press S and change scale. And select this USD 1, move to left, USD 2, move to right. Okay, so in this time, select this USD 1 and press P, move to Z axis like this. And USC 2, press P. Also, move to the axis to back. And Z 3. Move to like this. And 4, press P. Let's say again. Okay, that's good. And back to top view. Let's choose USC layers. Control D and move to like this. Move to right and control D again. Move to left. And let's delete this. And back to active camera. Okay, that's much more better. Preview animation. Okay, so select this camera and press P. Select these two frames, go to graph editor and choose this graph. Let's move to right. Full slow animation. And let's shift frame, move to left. And select let's shift frame, move to here. Nice. And select this dollar and move to down for hide these foots. Okay, very nice. So guys, for final scene, let's go to here and again back to the axis to back like this and select two frames, go to graph editor and select this graph. Let's move to left and this move to left and select this middle two frame, right click, two frame velocity, click continue and click OK and go to graph editor. Let's choose this two frame, move to WD bit and move to the left and this move right for more slowly and preview animation okay that's better i like it so let's back to two frames go to enable laptop one and two let's enable layers and turn on 3d layers and select this layer two link to layer one select layer one and press p and move to back press s and change scale like this. Move to center here. And let's see. 
okay we can change scale like this and move to down so in this time let's press p and go to here let's create new person in keyframe and move to right and move to front for hide laptop right now and move to back again okay let's see nice and let's hide in this part and make it two frames easy okay let's see nice i like it so in this time go to shape layers hold this icon and choose rectangle tool and let's go to less keyframe here create new rectangle tool and classification tool so let's change name display color and move to behind of layers and let's link to l2 move to right okay not bad let's see nice so select this display and press t open opacity change opacity zero and create opacity keyframe and go to here change 100 and make it keyframes easy let's see preview animation okay that's good so in this time let's choose this usd layer go to fs presses source effect wiggle and use wiggle rotation use for usd 24 and let's see can change speed here 15 and go to solo okay not bad and let's copy this wiggle rotation and select other usd layers ctrl v okay that's good let's preview animation nice i like it so guys for final let's go to project and import file choose dust and screen use let's click import and choose this screen and drag and drop into compensation and press s chain scale and turn off audio and let's click toggle switch mode go to mode choose here add let's see okay and select dust drag and drop into compensation press s chain scale turn off audio and again go to mod add okay nice so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel like video leave comments and have a good day good luck